Hi guys, so as is the return of the Great British Bake Off, I thought I could give baking a bit of a go. So I'm going to follow Mary Berry's simple banana loaf. So as a visually impaired person, it's slightly more tricky to be able to bake. So I like to get prepared before. So I normally measure all the ingredients out with a bit of help, obviously. And um, yeah, get it all prepared before I start doing the method. So for this delicious banana loaf, you will need 100 grams of soft, softened butter, 175 grams of caster sugar, two large eggs, two ripe bananas, 225 grams of self-raising flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, and two tablespoons of milk. So as it's quite a simple bake, all you simply do is chuck it all in one pot and get it all mixed up nicely. So I'm starting off with the bananas, the ripened bananas, so they're nice and soft. Just chuck them in and then gently mash them with a fork. That's the wrong way around. And then so on. And then the next step is to sieve, gently sieve the flour. Can get a bit messy, but we don't mind a bit of mess, do we? And a tip I would give you is to, when you're sieving in the uh, flour, also put in your baking powder as well, and then it'll be evenly distributed. So the next step is to mix it all together. This is where the fun bit starts with a little blender. Obviously you have to be careful and take it very steady, but um, here goes. Oh, I'm nervous. Whoa! So once you've got your uh, mixture lovely and mixed, you then uh, need a loaf tin, like so, to uh, pour it in, spoon it in. And you would, you could butter it up yourself, but I've got a uh, greaseproof paper instead just to make it that bit easier. So once it's done, start spooning it in. And remember to take it nice and steady. So once you've filled your loaf tin, you should have preheated your oven to 160 and then put it in for an hour. Obviously it might be worth a check at half time, but once that, you've got to leave it for an hour. So an hour has passed. I've now taken it out of the oven and let it cool down out of the tin. And now I'm ready to tuck into my delicious banana loaf. And now for the best bit, I get to taste the cake. Mmm, beautiful. Bon appétit!